Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kate Van Leuven and today is a super fun video because I'm going to be decorating my iPad case. I love decorating things with stickers and I ordered some new stickers from Redbubble so that's why it's so exciting. Similar to decorating my journal with me but I don't have a new journal this time. Instead we get to decorate this iPad case. So this is my iPad. It has a pen to it. This isn't the Apple pen. It's it's just a like random pen dupe. I think it was like $20. This this iPad isn't like the newest iPad so this pen isn't as good but the same brand makes an even better version of this pen because I can't put my hand on the iPad I have to be lifting up at all time but I've gotten pretty used to it so this iPad is technically an iPad Pro but it came out before the current iPad came out I received this iPad from my dad because I guess he wasn't using it I think he just gets like new technology um, because of his work and stuff so so got myself this iPad and it's very exciting. So I haven't had a case on this iPad and that's because I never really knew the size. I found out that this is a 9.7 inch iPad. But yeah, at first I couldn't figure it out. But I got it now. They actually had like a case that I wanted. I was afraid that all the pretty cases would be for the new iPad. A lot of them were so I'm actually really shocked that I was able to get this. So this is the cover. I can decorate some of this but I think I'll mostly do the back which is nice because it's actually just flat. The reason I wanted this one specifically is because first of all it's a nice color but also it has a pen slot for my stylus which is really nice because I tend to lose mine. Plus I, I just always keep them together so this will be convenient. This way I won't lose it. It's actually pretty good at not losing it even though I don't know where it is right now. Where did it go? Are you kidding? I just had it. I found it. And it can also like stand up do i put in let's just put the ipad in first why not also i really should give this little makeover with the lock screen and stuff a little more snazzy there we go it fits i will link this case and the pen down below they're both from amazon okay now i feel like i should decorate the front should i still do the back maybe i should start with this front area here but let me show you what stickers i got from redbubble redbubble is a really fun place to get some stickers for your journal or your ipad or whatever it is if it's your computer or your water bottle but it's really fun because you can really personalize it with some of your favorite things. So this first sticker is a scene from Whisper of the Heart, which is my favorite Studio Ghibli movie. Then on this one, I have a boba. I love boba. Boba is so great because I have a lot of tension in my face and in my jaw in that area. So the chewiness of the boba is very helpful. I don't know why this is like cut weird like this. Like I don't know if that's on purpose like I'm kind of confused then this sticker this is also a Studio Ghibli thing Studio Ghibli is just so like aesthetically pleasing and like just great films this is the little note from the flowers at the very beginning of Spirit Away and I just thought that was such a cool idea for a sticker and so unique then these are the last two this one means the most because it's also from Whisper of the Heart which is my favorite Studio Ghibli and it's when she is really working on her novel and she's just very passionate about it like I relate most to that character I literally just said this in my last video it's the same exact photo as the one I printed for my journal in my aesthetic photos video I explained it there too then this one is a play on the Pantone is that how you say it paint swatches instead it's strawberries and I literally printed this picture of strawberries as well so as you can see I really like them but yeah there's some satisfying about these and I saw these after I found that image and I was just very excited about it because I thought they're so satisfying. These are the stickers that I got so I'll definitely be incorporating a lot of these. Then we have all my individual stickers which I can incorporate some of these as well. This one might look cool with the green. I feel like I should save this one for my book journal otherwise it would be cool. This is such a cool one. We might be using the cat one. Stay committed to your dreams. Love that one. From all things Leanne. Look after yourself. Boba cat. Maybe the Fayette chill. Oh my gosh. 
God, will I be able to fit these back in here? This is a struggle right now. They are not going back in properly. Now, I actually have new All Things Lily Ann stickers, so let me go find those. This one is from Mochi Things, and these two are my new All Things Lily Ann stickers. So I feel like they're not really going to be seen if I put them on the back of my iPad. So maybe I'll put them all on the front. But like the problem is that a lot of them are too big to fit in like these middle parts and stuff. So I don't really know how I'm going to do this. Okay, see the question here is should I put stickers on the back? Like, will they just not be seen? But if I roll this up and, like, use it as a stand, then you can kind of see the back, and then you won't be able to see these. Why is this difficult? Maybe I just go minimal stickers on the front, nothing crazy, and see how that goes. Okay, here's what we've got so far. Why is a sticker like this? Maybe this one needs to go down a little bit. Yeah, I don't know where I'm going with this anymore. See, this can roll up. So maybe I put some stickers up here. Like, would that work? Maybe we keep it simple in the back. We'll have it simple and then on the front we have this so far. Let's see what we can do to help this. Oh, we can put my little Billy. I don't know where to put this one. Oh, see, this would fit. I feel like this is such a fail right now. Like, the problem is just that nothing fits properly and that is a problem. Okay, let me just show you what I've got here. I definitely think I need to schnaz this up with some stars real quick. Here we have my stickers. I want to go for a silver star. See, I have these silver stars, but actually these might work. We could try them out. No, why not? These are like thick. They're like almost on cardboard, but they should actually work better on this just because this is a flat surface. I like the accent of the stars. Makes it a little schnauzier. And then maybe I'll put a star on the back too, just to unify it. Sometimes when I try to peel off one of these, the layers will separate and that's why, that's another reason why they're kind of difficult to work with. I think the back looks really cute. It's really simple, but when you use this as like a little stand, the only thing that you'll be able to see is this. And it's not like anyone will really look at it, but it's the idea. You can kind of see it peeking, you know? Then when I close it, I get to see this little spread on the front. I purposely put these two together. It says stay committed to your dreams. And I do a lot of work on like things that I really love on the iPad because that's where I use like Procreate and things where I have to do some digital creation. And so just a nice little reminder. And then also the reminder of this movie where it's like a similar theme. This, I still don't know what's going on with the sticker and I'm not even gonna like cut it off because I don't know. Maybe I will at some point. I feel like the back might end up getting dirty, but the back is probably my favorite. I like how simple it is, and I love these colors with this green color. I love green. It's my favorite color, so love the case that I chose, and then I open it up, and I get my pen. So this is the outside of my iPad decorated. Basically all I'm gonna do, but we might as well spice it up while we're here and fix this lock screen, because look at this. It's a no. But 
let's go on to DuckDuckGo. DuckDuckGo is a safer thingamabloob than Google, even though I normally just use Google, but still, this is safer if you're wondering. What should we look up? Should we stick with the Studio Ghibli theme? Okay, let's see, Whisper, Whisper of the Heart wallpaper let's go with that let's see if it it even comes up with much because this is not like the most popular to ghibli movie let's see these are computers these are for computers i'm just gonna actually do like something else we're gonna look up aesthetic ipad wallpaper let's see what we're working with here Ooh, what is this okay i'm loving this we're going to th view the file. Why am I not good at this? I'm gonna add this to my photos. That one's simple, cute. Oh my god, and this one kind of matches. Okay, love that. Love the matching. Okay, we hold it down here. Add to photos. See, look at how plain this is. Okay, let's go to settings. I don't know why I haven't changed this. Let's, let, oh, what's with the shadows here, people? Do we want this as the background, the lock screen? Let's set both so we can choose for the other one. Why is it like making a gradient? Like, is that gonna disappear later on? Cause I want that to disappear. I feel like this should be the home screen. I don't know, I'm kind of in a cloud mood lately. So actually maybe set lock screen. Okay. Okay, that's cute. Okay, that's cute. I think that's cute. You know, it's simple just to schnazz it up a little bit. Then we got our new little case with the sticker. Here we go. Well, I think that's it then. I think we've got a nice decorated iPad. We'll see how I feel about it. See if it sticks. Maybe I'll try to fix it or something. But yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if it's normal to put stickers on the back. Because I feel like it is but I don't know. I just really like decorating things with stickers. It's really fun. And I can't wait until it's time for my next journal so I can decorate my journal cover with stickers. Get ready for that. I'll probably use some of the Redbubble stickers I didn't use and the All Things Lily Ann stickers. The new ones. This is an old one. So that is all. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I love when people decorate this kind of stuff. Subscribe if you're new because that would be amazing also follow my tiktok go on to my etsy my tiktok is kate van leuven underscore stationary and my etsy is star stationary supply and stationary is spelled with an a instead of an e i messed it up and i'm sad but it can be spelled either way so it doesn't matter and it's all one word and then the beginning of each word is capitalized it's so annoying in etsy you have to do it exactly otherwise it says like it can't find it so i'll just leave a link to that will be a lot easier i'll leave a link to that and oh my god my dogs so i'll leave my etsy link down below and i'll put my tiktok and my instagram it that's all automatically down there but by just subscribing or following me does support me a lot and especially etsy if you buy some of my stickers that's also super helpful for me but you totally don't have to yeah tell your friends i don't know spread the word about the channel that's about as much as i can shout out for today it's giving me a headache how much i'm talking about how you can support me so but thank you for watching this video and i will see you in my next one also, thank you so much for 350 subscribers. I don't know how many subscribers I'm going to have by the time I post this, but it's so, so exciting. So thank you for that. Okay, bye.